hello dear my beautiful people welcome I welcome you all back to the channel this is your girl Sherry Ann for those of you who are tuning into this channel for the very very first time I welcome you to the channel and I also welcome you to be a part of this family guys I have a word for someone to today um, <laughs> this is what the Lord have been speaking to me um, yesterday and the day before, um, the Lord was speaking to me about using his word, using his word, using his word, the word of God. Um, it says in, um, Hebrews 4, 12, the word of God is alive and powerful. It is sharper than the sharpest two edged sword cutting between souls and spirit between joint marrow only yesterday day before and I was speaking to a good friend um, whom I have met on this channel via whatsapp Instagram I was on with another friend um, whom I you know mentor the Lord have placed them within my hands um, within a few months a few months ago and so i have been walking with them through the their process um and i got so overwhelmed yesterday and their be day before um and as i was asking the lord you know why some of us have to go through um such things um, the Lord showed me a vision and he showed me in this vision a, um, snakes. I saw snakes in the vision. Um, the Sp Holy Spirit was just downloading um, in my spirit um, the evil plans and the plots of the enemy. The Lord has called or have called many of you um, and the enemy is after everything that is pertaining to you um it says the enemy came to kill to steal and to destroy and as i was speaking to a friend of mine yesterday you know i got so mad with the enemy you know it makes me mad when i see that the enemy is tampering with the children of god and um i was speaking to my friend and she was you know explaining to me every area in her life now is being attacked every area in her life is being attacked and uh, you know i got upset because we children of god when the enemy sees that we are so weak um he takes advantage and so today my message is to use the word of god whatever you are struggling with today you're struggling with finances in the word of god it says he will provide all of our needs according to um, his riches and glory and our father is a rich father if you are dealing with sickness cancer um asthma whatever sickness you are dealing with it is written in the word of god that by his stripes we are healed god is saying the spirit of the lord is saying that my people are not using my tools use the word of god it is written in hebrews 4 12 that the word of god is alive and powerful it is sharper than the sharpest two-edged sword cutting between soul and spirit use the word of god in the season whatever situation you are faced with whatever the enemy is coming against you with use the word of god and speak to that thing and command it to go you have the authority the lord says in his word that we have the authority to tread over serpents and scorpions and rulers of darkness in high places and none of them shall come nigh you it is written in the word of god that you have that authority god have given you that authority use it in the mighty name of jesus search the scriptures take time out write the scriptures out and speak it daily whenever the enemy come against your mind go to the word of god and speak it forth speak it forth the word of the lord is alive 
and powerful today. Children of God, do not allow the enemy to defeat you. Do not allow the enemy witchcraft and all these things. Yes, they are true. But if you are walking in the will of God, if you are walking with the Lord, they shall not touch you. They shall not come near you because it is written that we have that power, that authority the Lord have given us to tread over all those serpents and all those scorpions and all the rulers of darkness in high places. So that is my word to someone today. I hope this word encourage you. I have been receiving many emails of persons speaking about witchcraft and, and you know, all these different things. Witchcraft can have no power over you unless you allow it to. Speak the word of God over your life. You are a child of God. You walk with the spirit of the Lord. Command it to go. Satan has no authority over you. God is over you, over your life. Speak to him whenever he comes to tell you in contrary to the word of God, speak to that spirit and command it to go in the mighty name of Jesus. You have that authority in the mighty name of Jesus. So that's my word for today, guys. I thank you all for tuning in. I love you guys so much. Um, be blessed, stay blessed. And until my next one, I see you guys then. Bye.